Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Iranian citizens prefer Donald Trump over Biden due to consistent pressure on leaders. Iranian citizens prefer Donald Trump as U.S. president instead of Joe Biden, according to an expert. Iran expert Dr. Pupak Mohibali of Iran International TV, which is owned by Volant Media UK, explained the feelings towards the former and current U.S. presidents. During an interview with Express.co.uk, Dr. Mohibali argued Iranian citizens would have preferred Donald Trump remain U.S. president over Joe Biden. This is due to the strict pressure the U.S. put on Iran under Mr. Trump, leading to hope this pressure would result in positive change in the country. She noted Iranian officials were more indifferent to U.S. presidency however. Dr. Mohibali said, the views on Joe Biden and Iran, first we need to consider it people versus the officials of Iran as they think differently. I remember at Iran International TV, we asked people to send the voices on who they preferred to be the U.S. president. There were some people at the time said they preferred Donald Trump. Dr. Mohibali went into the details of why Iranian citizens were more supportive of Donald Trump than his election rival, Joe Biden. She said, they said they prefer if Trump was still the U.S. president because of they think of the kind of pressure he puts on the Iranian regime. They think it would be more helpful for any changes in Iran. However, because Biden is more diplomatic it gives more opportunities for the Islamic Republic. The Iran expert argued that from Iranian officials, the consensus is unclear. When it comes to the Iranian officials you can see a set of mixed signals. The ruling elite in Iran emphasized that is not important for them who becomes the U.S. president. Again, after Biden got elected they showed satisfaction that Trump is not the president anymore. Iran officials have argued that U.S. sanctions have caused hardship and suffering however. As president, Donald Trump dragged America out of a landmark deal and reimposed nuclear sanctions. The move resulted in Iran taking the U.S. to the ICJ in 2018. In September last year, Iran's Hamid Reza Alami Yazdi told the UN court the sanctions imposed by the US were a clear breach of the 1955 Treaty of Amity between the two nations. Speaking over a video link, Mr. Alami Yazdi said, the US measures and the underlying policy of maximum pressure disregard the very foundation of international law. Please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching.